Welcome to another CTV Sports presentation. CTV Sports is brought to you by St. Clair Chevy, Buick, GMC, We Care. By Murphy Inn, Restaurant and Hotel in St. Clair. By Ackett Soups in Adair and Marine City. By North Star Bank, North Star Guiding the Way. By St. Clair Chrysler, Jeep, Dodge, We Care. By Neiman's Family Market. By St. Clair's Ace Hardware and by CTV, Community TV in Marine City and St. Clair. Good day, basketball fans. Tuesday night from Marine City High School Gym. About ready to get underway here. Craig Zimmerman, Jerry Schneider. Good evening. Good evening uh, for St. Clair. Chelsea Swyweger, a senior, 5-1 guard. Starting it off for the Mariners number one, Antonia Potvin. For St. Clair, senior Miranda Gregg, number tw uh, 10. Number 14 for Marine City. Next up for the Mariners, Carissa Austin, the sophomore, number 14. Number 11 for St. Clair, Sarah Langusky. Next for St. Clair, junior Sarah Langusky. I just hope she gets her skills from her mother. Number 20 for Marine City. Next up for the Mariners, number 20, senior Kirsten Austin. Number 15 from St. Clair, Brookman. For St. Clair, number 15, junior Brookman. Number 21 from Marine City, Stephanie Abraham. Next up for the Mariners, freshman, number 21, Stephanie Abraham. And number 22 from St. Clair, Lexi Painter. And rounding out the starting five for St. Clair, senior, number 22, Lexi Painter. And number 30 for Marine And rounding up for the Mariners, sophomore, number 30, Paige Tranquita. So we've got Potvin, Austin, Austin, Abraham, and Tranquita for the Saints, Schweiger, Greg, Lunguski, Mon, and Painter. Supporting cast for the Mariners, number 3, Kylie Selecki, number 11, Alexa Pastoria, number 15, Desiree DeSnyder, 23, Madison McConnell, 33, Natalie Tipton, and 52, Erica Kellyu. For the Saints supporting cast, number four, Maddie Broski, 12, Peyton Schaefer, 14, Maddie Grapes, number 20, Hannah Plotsky, and number 34, Allison Gardner. Saints, of course, are coached by Brad Robbins, and the Mariners by Jeff Austin. I tell you what, I want to scold the fans and say, where in the heck are all the fans at tonight? This is a crosstown rivalry. Empty gym on a St. Clair Marine City night. Unbelievable. Well, hopefully they'll be watching on CTV6 and it'll be our highest rated game of the week. There you go. I like that. That's Ready good. to go jump ball here. It'll be Painter and Tranquita. Saints get it. Point guard will be Schweiger. Schweiger's a senior. Tipped St. Ball out of bounds. And City's coming out defensively in a straight man to man. Inbounding this time will be Miranda Gregg, the senior. Sarah Lunguski, top of the key. Looking inside. Nice box. Get it out front. This time to Schweiger. Nice anticipation that time by Abraham. There you go. Turnover, Saints. Mariners have it. Can they get jump ball? That'll go Mariner away. Nice hustle. Good help defense. Right away, I noticed different for Friday night. Marine City is definitely helping on that inbound uh, post pass. Full court pressure by the Saints. Opening minute. Tuesday night from Marine City High School. Craig Zimmerman, Jerry Schneider, and Logan Mead. Hopefully we got everything put together on the camera and everything so it all works and got voices nice. and the whole thing, right? <laughs> it's an amazing thing when we try to, we got an extra quarter. What do we do with this? We do? Well, we'll know. <laughs> we keep doing it to get better. First turnover of the night for the Mariners. Those are turnovers Marine City can't afford. That, that's a layup right yeah. there. To the corner, back across. To Greg, 
post, trying to go baseline. Puts it up, no. Rebound this time will be Mariners with Austin. Cross court. To the corner, three point shot. Looked pretty good, no, not quite. Good shot though. Nice rebound. Mariner the ball out of bounds. 6-16 left, no score. Saints and Mariners going at it on a Tuesday. Green City's out rebounding them on both ends right now. To the corner, three point shot. Short. Short, yep. Rebound. Long two or is it a three? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Mariner ball out of bounds. On Friday night, they were four for 19 from three point land. So hopefully that percentage improves yeah. tonight. Thought about it. Oh, she's open. Got to get her that entry pass. Looking in. Goes to the hole. Can't get it. Rebound. Jump ball. St. Way. Coach Austin saw that too. One more pass, and I can't remember who was on the block, but she was open. One more pass. Now, do your girls still play basketball in their intramurals or anything in college or out of college? Um, Erica plays a little bit. Um, Cassandra's into softball now. So. Okay. <laughs> but you know how that when you get yeah, that age. Yeah, right. Turn around, got it to go. First two points of the night, Brooke Mon. Ooh, a little foul there on Chelsea Schweiger, her first, team first. Carissa Austin, the sophomore to inbound. 5.23 left in the first, Saints up to zip. I think Friday night, Marine City's youth showed. Tonight. I hope tonight. Looking in. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh. Another, another giveaway. To the corner, three-point shot, Boom. yes! That time it's Carissa Austin. Three to two, Marine City on top, 455 in the first. Carissa certainly isn't shy about putting them up from out there. She's got a nice looking shot from out there. Taman looking to go baseline, top of the key, Greg. No, rebound nice Mariners. Nice block out Yeah, Tranquita did a nice yeah. job boxing out. Take it. Another three, wide open. Boom. Oh, look, good looking shot though. Got to take it. Yeah, I don't think no fall. Coach Austin would be upset with that at all. That's a wide open looking. Maddie Borowski's in for the Saints. She's a junior. To Lungusky, near side. Top of the key, Mon pulls it. Got it, nothing but net. Nice looking shot. She's got four. Four to three. Nice pass. Ooh. <laughs> Gotta hold on to those. Three point shot. Yes. Boom. Carissa Austin, her second one of the night, has all six. Six four Marine City. Three and 44 in the first. A good ball movement, wide open shot. You like that. Inside DeMond, nice defense that time by Carissa Austin. In the position in front of her. Chelsea Schweiger, gonna give that her second. Checking in for the Saints. We have number 12, Peyton Schaefer, number 20, Hannah Plotsky for the Mariners. Erica Kelly, number 52. Mariners were lucky to hold on to that one. She got a little too deep. Three point shot. Boom. Potvin for three. All nine points coming from threes. Nine four, three minute mark, first quarter. They didn't have any open looks on Friday. No. Not like no. that. Marysville playing real smothering defense. 
Stephanie Ibrahim got the hand on the ball that time. You know, you get a couple to start going down, and then it seems like everything starts falling. Help. In the paint. That's a freebie there. Peyton Schaefer's on the board with two. Nine to six. If you're going to give player of, the, player of the week honors on Friday night, you're going to give it to Stephanie Abraham for the Mariners. <laughs> I'll tell you what, Carissa Austin's lighting it up. She's got nine all off of threes, and it's 12 to six. No, they said her foot was on the line. They only oh. gave her two. Okay, she's got 11 six. She's got her stroke going right now. Mon going to go strong. Use the backboard, didn't get it. Going to be a jump ball. Marine City will get this one. And there, and no doubt, last Friday, the freshman, Stephanie Abraham, yeah. she played very well, very well. It's always exciting to see a freshman play so well, knowing that you've got this development time in front of them. Three more years. Yeah. <clears throat> She's serious about basketball, which is good, so she'll only get better. Nice pass. Nice pass. Oh, Caliu. Yes, in the off. paint. Nice feed and nice using the backboard. 14-6, Mariners on top, just under two minutes left in the first. It's night and day from Friday night. I don't think we had 14 points at halftime. <laughs> I think you're right. I don't even want to look at that score sheet. <laughs> we had one bucket like in the first minute and then it had nothing yeah. till like end of the first or, or the beginning of the second. I think it was the beginning of the second. Mon for a long two, in and out. That one was three quarters of the way down. It's a good looking shot. Yeah. Oh, lost the handle. Schaefer pulls up to Lunguski, top of the key. Oh. Oh. Underneath, looking, kicking it out. Plotsky's paying the post. Timeout St. Clair, just under a minute to play. Mayor's on top 14 6, CTV, Marine City St. Clair. Those fucking roads were terrible though. Well, it's being two, three inches. Here we go. Painter to inbound. Gets it into Lunguski. Top of the key, Peyton Schaefer. Looking underneath, Lunguski in the corner. Kicks it out. Good ball moving by the Saints. 40 seconds left in the first. Roll into the hole, got it. Oh man, got a bad roll on that one nice for Painter. Looking inside, back out. You can hear Coach Austin over here. <laughs> He's yelling out some plays. Oh! No man's land. Nine seconds, three point good shot. Good. Look good for me. Oh, just off the front. 4.8 ticks on the clock. Green City owns the backboards right now. That'll put Erica Kelly at the line, her first appearance from the charity stripe. Shooting two. She was standing under the basket all by herself. There wasn't even oh, a red got it. Around. Shooter's roll on that one. She's got three. Got over the line. <laughs> Remember on Friday, I thought she did that on that. <laughs> <laughs> she has a nice looking stroke. Yeah. It's not bad. 15 to 6, four seconds remaining in the quarter. Out of bounds with a second left. Going to be tough to get one in the bucket here. I can't remember. High schools have to go through the hoop or out of the, hand? out of the hand? Okay, out of the hand. Not going to, not on this one. A nice effort. At the end of one quarter, 15 for the hometown Mariners, 6 for the Saints. We'll be right back. CTV, Marine City, St. Clair. Ackett's Soups from Scratch has a new location on King Road in Marine City. 
Ackett's Soup from Scratch features all their famous soups, but now they have a complete lineup of lunch and dinner items for eat in or take out, and even frozen items for heat and eat. You know Ackett's soups are made from scratch. Fresh vegetables, herbs, and hand-rolled noodles. Stock simmered for long hours to bring out aroma and flavor of real homemade soups. Ackett's soups from scratch in Adair and now also in Marine City on King Road. North Star Bank, guiding the way. North Star Bank is a true community bank whose loan approvals are made locally. They help keep our communities vibrant and growing by making loans to local families and businesses and reinvesting back into our community. From opening accounts to recommending products and services, they look forward to reach your financial goal. North Star Bank, guiding the way. Member FDIC, an equal housing lender. All loans are subject to credit approval. Here we go, quarter number two. Craig Zimmerman, Jerry Schneider with a G. With a G. <laughs> okay. Logan Mead on camera. Tuesday night. Ooh. Lunguski threw it intended that time for Painter. It's a nice backdoor cut, too. On the floor for the Mariners, we have Natalie Tipton, Antonia Potvin. Long. Along with. Stephanie Abraham, Madison McConnell, and Paige Tranquita. For the Saints, we've got Lexi Painter, we've got Sarah Lagusky, Chelsea Schweiger, Lexi Painter, did I say? Brookman. Brookman. I think I got them all. I think Miranda Gregg. There we go. Ooh. All the way. Ooh, got a little slap there. You can hear it up here. Fans 7 12 left shortly. in this half. At the line, Stephanie Abraham, the freshman, her first appearance at the line. A little short. Shooting a pair. Looking for her first point of the night. Got it. See Split a pair. 16-6 mirrors up. Painter looks in. Come on. Oh, nice. oh she's going to go three. Brookman has six, looking to go for seven. It's a nice, strong, strong play. Oh, yeah. Yep. Doesn't convert. Mariners get the rebound as Paige Tranquita gets it. Potvin out front. Oh, wide open in the corner. Couple seconds earlier. Nice, nice look. Kick it out. Nice one. From the elbow. Oh. Mon gets a rebound. Oh, that's this time to Linguski. She's going to take it all away. Oh, my goodness. I thought I would have saw something. <laughs> Sarah Linguski will go to the line shooting two. Six and 33 left in the half. Lunguski a little short on the first one. Short on the second one, rebound, Tranquita. Cross court, good ball movement. Long two or three, yeah, it didn't matter. Rebound, nice put back. Oh, can't get it to roll. Surprised St. Clair staying in their zone. We're out rebounding them out yeah. of that zone. We're getting wide open looks. Lungusky, 15 footer, short. Rebound this time, it'll be Austin. Wide open three, no, nope. gonna drive it. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Lost the handle. 
Got it to the corner. Take it. Potvin. No. Re nice position. Put back. Can't get it. Rebound again. That's a bunch of rebounds. Turnover Marine City. Jeez. Coach. One and coach likes it, one coach doesn't. <laughs> yeah, that's typically the way it goes. <laughs> and Marine City is doing a really nice job attacking the zone. They're getting any shot they want right now. Got a technical on Coach Brad Robbins. In for the Saints. Maddie Borowski's in. Hannah Plotsky is in as well. No good on the first from Carissa Austin. All the amount to is two shots because the Mariners did have the ball. Oh. oh, in and out, around the horn we go. So it really didn't co cost Coach Robbins anything. You still argue when that call. <laughs> A different ref, though. Um, calmly. Though. A different ref. A little calmer. Duly noted, he says. There'll be a makeup call for that at some point. <laughs> he did his job. Checking in for the Mariners, Kirsten Austin, the senior. And Natalie Tipton will come off. Inbound this time goes to Potvin. Look at that's wide open. Yeah, nice look. Nice oh, nice feed. Got it. Paige Tranquita, her first two of the night, makes it 18 to eight. Manny Borowski leads it up court. Looking in, nice position, good position that time by Plotsky, drew the foul. I think, so, I, I, I know I said it earlier, but I really think St. Clair's gotta come out of that zone. Look. Marine City is really getting easy, uncontested shots out of that right now. Schweier to inbound, gets it in. Jump shot right away, error. Marine City comes up with it. Just under five minutes to play in the half. 18 to eight, Marine City on top. One more pass, swing it, swing it, wide open. Right, yep, in the corner. Boom, pops in. Six points on the night, makes it 21 to eight. Yeah, I think if you just man up and think. just pester them, just be a pest. Yep. And that's what Marysville did well the other night. Very well. They're in their face. Not allowing them shots like that. No, I'm not sure they had too many uncontested shots, that's for sure. Saints ball out of bounds. Borowski to inbound from the south side. Goes deep. This time, got it into Plotsky. Looking in, nice position by Mon. I don't know who they call that on. They called that on Mon. Okay. Off. You know what's interesting is that I didn't see the push off. I just saw the trailing edge of it. She didn't have to either. No. Because she had a good position. You know, I. That, I don't even know if I'd have called that. Right, it wasn't, you know. wasn't much of a push. Three point attempt, no good. Rebound Mariners. Mariners dominating the boards. Halftime, see if you can go get the st stats on. Well, it's gotta be pretty incredible. Turnover Marine City. Schweiger, near side to Borowski. And on, on this end, they're limiting St. Clair to one shot. I mean, St. Clair's getting one shot, that's it. Yeah. Checking in for the Mariners, Madison McConnell for the Saints. It'll be Sarah Lunguski as Schweiger gets a little rest. Inbounding Maddie Borowski underneath 
front of us. Nice position there in the defense, but that time Plotsky stole it back. <laughs> a nice screen. Langusky lost the handle, jump ball. Green City Way. Starting to see a little bit of that rivalry chippiness coming into the game. Yep. Is always right in the rivalry games, but you can start seeing a little, <laughs> little more intensity. Nothing better than a Friday night off at East China Stadium with a rivalry. That's no, the best. Absolutely not. Jump shot. Boom. Ten Boom. footer, no good. Rebound, Mariners. <laughs> this time it'll put Tranquita at the line, shooting two. Are they seen on the floor? No, oh, shooting two. She's yeah. She's got to be shooting two there. I hope. Green City slowed down scoring here in the second quarter, but they are limiting St. Clair to one shot, one shot. No good on the first. There will be no second. <laughs> oh. oh, intended that time for Miranda Gregg. Inbound will go uncontested. Under three minutes of play in the half. 21-8, Marine City on top. Oh. Leading all so far tonight, Carissa Austin with eight. Nice feet inside. That's oh. gotta be, that's not a foul, okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm not saying I blame I mean, her for going after it, but she was. pass interference to the NFL. I mean, armor well, it depends who's playing. Oh, true, true. <laughs> Don't even get me started on that no, subject. No, no, no. Oh. I'm so sick of the NFL refereeing. It's like these rules that are like. Just let us play football. How about you catch the ball? If you catch it and you're two feet down, you're in. Right, exactly. Nice tip that time in, by Carissa Austin. As, as bad as the Lions got it, I, then, I, think, then, I honestly think Dallas got they it. They got robbed too. That was a catch. Yeah, that was a catch. He was stretching for a yep. touchdown. I mean, there's no doubt about that. Yep. 217 left in the half. 21 8 Marine City. We'll be right back. Two seventeen left in the half. Mariners in the in the bonus. Twenty one eight. Inbounding for the Saints. Maddie Borowski from the far side gets it in this time to number twelve. Peyton Schaefer. Oh. Langusky thought about it. Kicked it back out. Borowski, three point attempt oh. off the side. Rebound. Potvin. Three-point shot. Oh, in and out. Rebound, Mariners. They're quick to call that one. Should be going to the line, shooting one and one. <laughs> At the line, Erica Kelly. She's got three points. One from the line. Off the side. Rebound. Lunguski. To the corner. Nice shot that time by Hannah Plotsky. She's on the board with two. 21 10, minute 32 left in the first half. Craig Zimmerman, Jerry Schneider, Tuesday evening here. Logan Mead on camera. Offensive foul. That'll be on Erica Kellyu. Obviously a little bit of a shoving underneath. Checking in for the Mariners, Stephanie Abraham, the freshman. Schaefer. Jump ball. Mariners will get it. I 
left. One, one, one left in the quarter number two. Diving on the floor. I love that hustle. Yep. Checking back in, Kirsten Austin, senior. At the end of the first quarter, we we're Marine City 15, St. Clair 6. Not much scoring. So 6 for the Mariners in the second quarter and 4 for the Saints. Nice feet inside. Kicks it out. Open shot. Good ball movement. Looking nice in. Pass. Nice block. Mariners will get the ball with 53 seconds left. It's good all the way around. Nice offense. Good defense. Inbounding will be Austin. Potvin for three, no. Rebound Saints. Langusky comes up with a jump ball, goes Saints way this time. There's something we didn't see on Friday night. Marine City put a little pressure, yep. full court pressure. Doing a good job too. <laughs> time out just in the nick of time. 30 second time out. 42.7 seconds left in the half. Going to scoring here. Carissa Austin with eight. Six for Potvin. Three for Kaliu. Two for Tranquita. One for Abraham. For the Saints. Got six for Mon. Two for Schaefer. Two for Potsky. And two for Langusky. I'm sorry, no. Lankuski had two free throws, no good. That's it. Yeah. Five scores. Three clear. Balance both ways. Inbounding from the north side, Peyton Schaefer, the senior. Full court pressure once again by the Mariners. 42.7 left in the half. Gets it in this time to Lankuski. Lost the handle, turnover. Wow. <laughs> How do they not call that? Oh, they're going to call, call that, it. right? <laughs> I'm not blaming any of the kids, but it's like if you're not going to call it, they're going to keep pushing. Bodies flying <laughs> everywhere. Somebody blows on the other one up, sorry. And then we'll get calls from uh, parents from both sides saying we complained about it. No. <laughs> <laughs> We're not. What's this? What are they saying? St. Clair called a timeout. Oh, timeout. <laughs> Just before the five seconds expired, I guess. 30-second timeout. Time for station identification. CTV, Marine City, St. Clair. If you notice a little... little Ernie Harwell, I should <laughs> What did you, you the know game last night? I didn't watch any of it. I can't stay up that late to watch these nine o'clock games. It's kind of crazy that it's that late, but you it, know, say what you want, whoever you're rooting for. What? Well, I tell you, I Ohio was rooting. State. I was rooting against against Ohio State the whole time. I mean, I didn't want to see him win, but there is no doubt who the best team is. Third string quarterback, and they're running all over Oregon. Yeah, they, they just so incredible. I mean, that is. Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely not an Ohio yeah. State fan. Yeah, either, but, but you, yeah, you can't it. deny it. Right. There's no denying that. Um, and the way I, two preseason polls came out already for next year, and they're number one next year, too. Well, yeah, I mean, why not, right? Well, they're only losing like 12 kids. Yeah, and, and, and this year they weren't really healthy. No. <laughs> Twenty seconds remaining in the half. Borowski, short, rebound. Easy, easy. Mariners come up with it. Carissa Austin. Last shot. Take her. Think about the highlight films from the national championship football game last night. Five and ten in twenty years from now. Three point oh. shot, no good. We'll end the half at 21-10, Marine City. But think of the the. Uh, the, the the aura that that game will have, the fact that the third string quarterback and uh, Urban underdogs. Meyer, Urban and Meyer said that'll be a game talked about. Oh, forever. we'll be, we'll He's be. He's right. We'll be right back. He's right. Murphy Inn, Restaurant, Spirits, Hotel, all in St. Clair. Before or after the game, stop at Murphy Inn. Different specials every day. Happy hour, two to six daily. 
and seven vintage hotel rooms. Half off large pizza every Monday, karaoke on Wednesday and Saturday, live music on Thursday and Friday. Murphy Inn has private dining area for showers and family parties. Murphy Inn, restaurant, spirits, hotel, in St. Clair since 1836. Neiman's Family Markets, from produce, deli, bakery, meats, or even bagels. Neiman's Family Markets, they have it all on Kearney Drive in St. Clair. Neiman's Family Markets. Here we go, second half underway. Mayor's on top, 21-10, same score as when we left. How'd that happen? <laughs> And here we are. Let's go over the five starters for both sides. For the Mariners, we got Potvin. We've got Abraham along with Austin. Another Austin. And Paige. Paige Tranquita. For the Saints, who we got there, Jerry? We got Brodsky. We got Longusky. Mon. Gre Greg. Miranda Gregg. And I'm missing one, Schweiger. So both teams come out the same same way they started the game. Except Brodsky. Ah, good, good. <laughs> yes, you're right. But Saints I, ball, out of bounds. Brodsky had a nice first half yep. for St. Clair. Very active, involved. Inbounding this time will be Chelsea Schweiger. She's a senior. We were talking about rebounds in the first half, and Marine City out rebounded St. Clair 15 to 4 in that first yeah. half. That's Unofficially in turnovers, St. Clair with seven, Marine City with six. Potvin leads it up court. I'm imagining at uh, halftime. Coach Austin probably said, continue to do what we're doing. I don't think he'd <laughs> want to change much, for sure. Top of the key, jump shot, nope. Good rebound, put back, oh, got it. Paige Tranquita wrestles for it, earns it, she's got four. Green City just continues to own the glass. Yeah, they're getting two to three shots every time. Five seconds. Nice defense by Kirsten Austin. I think Miranda Gregg just lost her footing on one of those pivots. Because <laughs> there was nobody really pushing her. Oh, oh. Nice steal there by Maddie Broski. And she connects. She's on the board with two. That'll make Mrs. Broski happy for a little bit. <laughs> Nice looking player. Been a nice game so far tonight. Offense. Yeah. Legal screen. 23 12, 6 and 15 left in the third quarter. Inbounding will be Chelsea Schweiger. Schweiger, far side. Mayor's playing good. Defense. Oh, intended that time for Schweiger. Another throwaway for the Saints. Right just up. yep, just under six minutes left in the third. So Marine City can get some of those wide open <coughs> shots they were getting in the first half. Just like that. It's good A little off on that one. Oh, that goes to Lunguski. Schweiger looking in. Good idea. Tipped St. Clair ball out of bounds. Looks like Coach Austin's wanting his guards to come up and, and apply a little more pressure right here in the third quarter. Calu comes in. Court. Tranquita comes off. Inbounding will be Maddie Borowski. Broski out front, hounded by Potvin. 
Going to go baseline. Goes pretty strong. Can't get it to fall. Mirror ball out of bounds. She made a nice move. Yep. 23-12. At the end of the half, it was 21-10. Steal by the Saints. On the line. In by be Carissa Austin. The younger of the Austin sisters. Poppin to the corner. Austin, three-point shot, short. Rebound. That'll be Saints ball out of bounds. That was a nice block out by Miranda Gregg right there. I haven't seen St. Clair do that much tonight. That was a very nice block out. Almost lost it. Broski looking in. Back out. Nice idea. Mon going to go baseline. No, lost the handle. Broski pulls the coat. Oh, it looked pretty good from here. Off by a couple inches. I thought, it, I thought it was going down. Poppin kicks it out. Your Marine City guy get something. In down. the paint. Like there we go. Cal U. Oh, nice using the board. She's got five. Just like that. She's got a good night underneath in the paint. Erica is a junior. Doesn't list our heights here, but I gotta believe a uh, little trip there. <laughs> She's gotta be 5'11. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say. Yep. Rebound mirrors as Austin comes up with it. And I like the fact she's strong down low too. She's, she's nice and strong. Oh, good feed there. Oh. <laughs> I would have to agree with that. <laughs> I didn't so see a whole lot. Feed into Kelly, you lose the handle. Mon gets it. Jump ball. Saints will retain or grab possession on that one. That'll be a turnover, Mariners. Maddie Borowski to inbound from the south side. Into Schweiger. Far side, Schaefer. Driving. Oh, Kicks it out, but I think she got an extra step in there. You know, she'd have been better off stopping and shooting it off the board there. Tuesday night from Marine City High School. We'll be back here Friday night for the boys game. Looking forward to that. First boys game of the year. Looking in. Oh, nice, nice turnaround. Can't quite get it to roll. Saints come up with it as the rebound goes to Schaefer. Have some uh, pretty good boys teams in the area. Yeah, I was looking today, I think Yale's fifth or sixth in Class B, and New Haven is eighth, so. I guess he's telling some student, this guy go home. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine that. <laughs> he must have been on him. I didn't hear anything. You better go get him. better watch it, ladies. I got Dean kicked out. If I get it. Yeah. He's horrible. He's horrible. I'm going to do it this way. He kicked out. He kicked out. He kicked Three minute mark left in the third. 25 to 12. Marine City on top. I was lost for words when I said student and I saw some gray hair poke up. <laughs> And then another parent up here says oh, they kicked so and so last week in St. Clair. Well, now unfortunately, you're going to see the whistle start blowing a lot more, and it's at the line. Chelsea Schweiger, her first appearance at the line, looking for her first point of the night, shooting two.
It's Got it. Been kind of nice. I mean, there's only been four fouls in this quarter so far. Yep. Nice flow to the game, and it's. Brooke Mann checks in. Schweiger looking to make it a pair. There we go, 25-14. Schweiger's got two. Marine City's went into a little bit of funk. I mean, we well, scored 10 it's four to four in the third, in the third here. I mean, it's, uh, they didn't score many points in the second quarter either. Three on one. Nice, nice bounce pass. <laughs> Textbook right there. Six for Paige Tranquita. Maybe they heard me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Sticking the same. Long one, no good. Rebound, Mariners. This time it'll be Kelly. Yeah, keep the tempo going. Yep. To the corner. Looking in. Battle going on underneath. <laughs> Look at that. She's not going to back away. This time it'll be Tranquita going to line for two. That's the way to do it. Paige has got six. Looking for her first free throw from the line. Shooting two. <laughs> Off the back. Checking in for the Saints, number 20, Hannah Plotsky. She's a junior. Short on the second. Yeah, Rebound wild. Saints. They're going to have to watch that. Plotsky comes up with it. Who shot that one? Is that uh, Lunguski or? Yes. Sarah Lunguski's on her line. She got, was that a two or three? It was a two. Yeah, they're starting to call more fouls. I, th I think they're a little, little leery. They don't want it to get too chippy. Checking in for the Saints. Miranda Gregg, the senior. Brooke Mann comes off. Inbound by Potvin for the Mariners. Goes deep. Looking inside. Nice move. Nice move, yeah. Can't get it to fall, but nice shot. Tranquita, another sophomore in there. Another three short. Rebound Mariners. And Marine City's going to have a few good years coming up here. Kelly U kicks it out. Ten footer. Oh. No. Nice another, another nice job. Good, excellent positioning by Paige Tranquita drawing the foul. You notice how she kept the ball up. Keep it up. Right Don't bring it down, right? right. Perfect. So many times, Biggs get yeah. the ball, bring Come it down, down and then boom. Jump ball or yep. it's a steal or. In and out. Green well, City hasn't been very good from the free throw. No. <laughs> Two of 11. Mm. There we go. Three of 12. Tranquita's got seven. <laughs> They need to watch her feet go. Every time she shoots, she crosses that line because she shoots a little jump shot. Well, it could cost them um, one of these games. A nice strong one to the hole. Can't get it. Mariners come up with the rebound. This time it's Abraham. Potvin, who thought she was going to pull it. Caliu. Nice. Nice. Can't quite get it to roll, but nice effort. Schweiger. To Longusky, no. Oh my gosh, no. Some looked like somebody got hammered. <laughs> Two on nothing. Potvin got it. Eight for Potvin, looking to make it nine, a possible three point play. 108 left in the third. So if you're a coach and you get a technical, you can't get back up off the bench. Cause I've noticed the same yeah. coach hasn't been up since. I think that's an unofficial rule. Yes, make a three-point play for Potvin. She leads all Mariners with nine. 
Good balance attack by the Mariners tonight. And you know they've gotten it inside and they've gotten yeah. it outside. And that's, the that's what makes it. Yep. That's what makes your outside shot work when you're working it in. I've really been impressed with their low post play today. Just very nice. Inside. Second shot. Oh. Two shots. This time it'll be Hannah Plotsky, the junior at the line, shooting two. First appearance at the line. Oh, right. they had three or four of those tonight. Oh, same thing. Well, once again, two white shirts around that ball. Yep, Stephanie Abraham comes up with a rebound. She does a pretty efficient job with both her right and left hand. It's not over and back. It's going to be St. Clair ball because it touched it last. As the years go by, you, that won't happen. She'll get a little stronger, right. a little stronger up her body, and they won't be able to take that ball from her like that and knock it away like that. Maddie Broski to inbound. 45.7 seconds left in the third. Mares on top, 31-16. Painter goes wow. some good line for two. If I'm Coach Austin, I'm irritated right now. I mean, that, that is a bailout call. That's yeah. a wild shot. She's got no chance of making anything with that. And, and, he, and Coach is calm and collected over there. She forced the contact. I mean, If it was a close, if he'd, game, have, hey, sure he'd, if he'd have thrown it the other way, though, we'd have to take two other parents and throw them out of the gym. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably so. No good on the first. Two of seven for the Saints right now. Wow. Two of eight. Rebound, Calu. Timeout Marine City, 33.2 seconds in the third. We'll be right back. I hated that. Okay, here we go. Inbounding for the Mariners. Going deep, deep. No, oh, lost the handle. Oh, just a little bit out of reach. Not a bad idea. Perfectly called. You got to underthrow that. Turnover Marine City. Oh, turnover St. Clair. Unofficially number 10 for the Saints, 8 for the Mariners. 24.5 seconds left in the third. Natalie tipped into inbound. Oh my goodness, that was a travel. <laughs> Back to Tipton, far side, 18 seconds and counting. 14, 14. Checking in for the Mirrors, Desiree DeSnyder. There we go, wide open. That looks good. Three, oh, just short. Rebound, Saints, oh. <laughs> Jump ball, Mariners will retain possession on this one. Plenty of time to get a good shot. Chelsea, don't let her shot go around you. Push her back. Take her out, Benny. Take her out. Here goes. Make the shot. Make the shot. Oh. At the end of three, 31 16, Marine City on top. We'll be right back. Marine City, St. Clair, S. CTV. St. Clair's Ace Hardware in the Riverview Plaza is now open seven days a week for your shopping needs. Everything you need from auto supplies, wiring, paint, craftsman tools. St. Clair's Ace Hardware has picnic items, a complete gift department with candles and more. Don't miss the specials on Valspar paint. St. Clair's Ace Hardware in the Riverview Plaza. Chelsea. 
opening part, fourth quarter. Craig Zimmerman, Jerry Schneider, and Logan Mead. Yeah. Right off the bat, Brooke Mond scores two. Oh. She's got eight on the night. Turnover, Mariners. 31-18, Mariners get it back. Nice hustle. De Schneider out front. Back to the corner, looking in. Dangerous pass. Strong. Going baseline, eight footer, nope. Got their own rebound, Mariners got it. Better get out. <laughs> Three point shot, short. Rebound Mariners, third shot. Fourth shot. De Schneider, eight footer, no. Fifth shot. <laughs> and they have just totally owned that glass. Yeah. De Schneider. Oh. How come? I think he called it on uh, Cali. Um, illegal screen. 31-18, seven minutes left in the game. You know, for a defense, that's very disheartening. You play that defense, yeah. and the rebound, you got to play defense and play defense. And Nice feed into Mon. She's going to go to line shooting two. Although I question whether that was a shot. I think that was on the floor, but. Six in 53 left in the game. Plenty of time for St. Clair to make a run. No good on the first. Short. Saints shooting 20% from the line. Two of ten. Yeah, when you're behind, that's a killer. Mares. Nice. Four out of 13. Nice, nice. feed inside. Tranquita. She's nice. got nine. Nice. Tied for the lead. Snyder. Beautiful. 33-18. Ow. <laughs> yep, they're going to be shooting here on out. One and one. Yep. At the line, Chelsea Schweiger. She is two of two from the line. Two of three. Nice block out by Marine City. 33-18. De Schneider looking inside the paint. Tranquita from 12 feet, no good. Rebound, this time goes to Greg. Outlets to Lunguski. Lunguski drives long off Mann's back. The Schneider, far side pot, then thought about it, drives, kicks it back out. Pot then three, nope, short. Rebound this time goes Mann. Maddie Borowski, gonna go end to end. Nice. Can't get it to fall. This time it'll be Brooke Mon at the line shooting two more. Well, she just split the defense and went right to the basket. That was a nice move on her part. Made that one look easy. Yeah, if you're in Marine City, you just need to be patient. Move the ball let, and let the game. clock roll down. Right. Like they were in the first half when they when they were making that one extra pass, someone was wide open every time. 33-19, Mariners on top. In case you're just joining us, Mariners led at the end of one quarter, 15 to six. At the half, Mariners were up 21-10, and at the three-quarter mark, 34-16. <laughs> We are now at 30, I'm sorry, it's 31-16. It's now 33-19. Pop into the corner. That's not a kick. 
<laughs> I don't know how it wasn't. Langoski. Nice defense. Now, there's no foul. Nice defense right there. Straight up. Porosky to inbound from the north side. Seeing Mariner ball. Checking in for the Mariners, Erica Kelly. Inbounding will be Stephanie Abraham. She's been quiet tonight. Abraham pulls up top of the key, long one, no. Rebound, Calu, and Mares come up with it. Oh. That's a foul. <laughs> Can't get it, a little long. Calu puts it up, no. Saints come up with it. Schweiger. Taking it to Strong, can't get it. Mariners come up with a rebound. Carissa Austin. Pull it out, there you go. Long one, nope. Rebound Mariners, right place at the right time that time. And Stephanie Abraham's got three. 35-19, four and 24 left in the game. Borowski kicks it out, turnover. Better watch out on this one. <laughs> they had hammering written all over it, didn't they? Well, yeah. One from <laughs> yeah. one side, one from the other. In a boys game, those don't end well. <laughs> Someone would have been sliding against <laughs> yeah. the, the stage wall. I know. That'll put Potvin at the line. She's got one from the line, nine points tonight. See if she can be the first Mariner in double digits. She's played a nice game tonight. Yeah. Good. You can't get it. I would imagine tomorrow in practice the girls are going to be working on free throws. In the paint, kicks it out. Mon for two, gets it. She's got 11. Nice. Nice feed to Kelly. She's got seven. 37-21, under four minutes to play. You gotta love it when your center's beating guards down the court, getting wide open shots like that under the basket. Uh, a little bit too much there. That'll be on Carissa Austin, or I'm sorry, Kirsten Austin. You know, the way Marine City's shooting free throws tonight, if I was St. Clair's coach, maybe you start fouling. Put them on the line. <laughs> Well, plus you have the clock stop, too. Yep. Little Shaq rules. Now, now I think they're the Andre Can't Drummond the rules. <laughs> <laughs> Maddie Gapshee's her first point of the night. That hit the rim. That's why the ball went straight down. <laughs> I have a question. I'm looking, looking at these new banners they have up in the gym here. Why do they not have state championships listed? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> that would be a natural, wouldn't it be? Well, I mean, I, I there's not many, but I, there's they're a, not on this wall you've yet, got so. the banners, yeah. Tranquita got it stolen. <laughs> on the line or push? What are they saying? going to be shooting. Three and 20 left, Mariners up by 15 at 37-22. Is that a fifth foul? I think it is. Got to tell that Ryan Westeroff, he's got to tell us uh, with the buttons uh, how many fouls there are. Yeah, Mon will follow out with three and 20 left in the game. She'll be Substituted to Hannah Plotsky. At the line is Carissa Austin. Oh, looking good. 
her first shot from the charity stripe. She's got nine. Yeah, we have that nice feature on these new boards. They can yeah. use it. Make our jobs a little easier. First Mariner with 10 points tonight. Carissa Austin, two of four from the line with 10. Really balanced approach tonight for the Mariners offense. We'll go over that scoring before the end of the game. Turnover Saints. Unofficially number 13 to the Mariners, 10. Abraham to inbound, full court pressure by the Saints. Nice. Thought about it, oh nice feed inside. Oh, oh no, you gotta take that one, yep. gotta take it. Yep. There are times you can beat two on something. Time out, 3.05 left, 39, 22 Marine City on top. What was that about? I'm not sure what happened. I, I thought we had possession of the ball when Coach Austin called timeout, but maybe Jerry Jones called over and made it. <laughs> Saints in double bonus. Mariners have 10 fouls. Saints have eight, so Mariners in single bonus. Meaning you shoot one-on-one oh one if you're the Mariners. Foul. Pull her down. <laughs> I got that one. That'll put Paige Tranquita at the line shooting one and one She is one of five at the line with nine points. Let's get at least one, get another Mariner in double digits. That'd be nice. Got it. Ten points. I think that's definitely something Coach Austin and his staff will touch on. Like balance scoring, the huge difference in rebounding. Short rebound Mariners, put back, oh, almost. Got it again. Lost the handle. Saints come up with it. Schweiger. Let's go to line shooting two. Mariners up 40-22 at two and 25 left in the game. Checking in for the Saints. In and out, man. Erica, I'm sorry, Allison Gardner, Jr. She checks in. First action of the night. Yep, Plotsky comes off. Oh, man, I tell you, those rolls are not going the Saints' way. Jump ball. Mariners will retain possession. Inbounding for the Mariners, Stephanie Abraham. Full court pressure, as you can see, by the Saints. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I don't think Marine City will be in a hurry to get a shot. Oh, boy. Wholesale changes, Mariners, let's see, we've got 23, Madison McConnell coming in. Got De Snyder back in. Kellyu, Tipton, and Abraham rounded out. Driving for the Saints, no good that time by Graffitz. Rebound to Snyder. <laughs> She, she went McConnell. to roll that a little bit. Well, she saw McConnell breaking down here, and I think she just couldn't get the handle to get yep. it down there. Unofficially number 12, turnover for the Mariners, 13 for the Saints. We'll be right back. Oh. 
Inbound this time goes Longusky. Just under two minutes to play in the game. Sarah Longusky, long two. Nope. Rebound. Jump ball. Saints will retain it. Down underneath. Maddie Borowski to inbound. To the corner, Broski back. Long one. Oh, in! Maddie Borowski, her first three of the night. She's got five. Forty twenty-five minute twenty left. At this point, Mary just really play for a last shot. Just keep the ball. Coach Austin calling the signals in. We can hear him. Still working it. Nice Tipton kicks it out. Oh, oh, got it. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie Abraham's got five, looking to make it six. Let's see if we can get our second three-point play of the night. That was a very nice entry pass by DeSnyder. Wow. Threaded a needle to get it down there. Then they made the extra pass, and you get that three-point play. Got it. Three-point play for Stephanie Abraham. Looks like she'll finish with six points. Go over the scoring here, Jerry. Uh, very balanced for the Mariners. Carissa Austin, 10. Who scored that one? Uh, Maddie. Maddie Gapsus. So 10 for Austin, 10 for Paige Tranquita, 9 for Potvin, 7 for Calu, 6 for Abraham. Pretty balanced attack for the Mariners, yeah. That's for anything better now. For the Saints. Two for Schweiger. Two for Broski. I'm sorry, five for Broski. Two for Lunguski. Two for Schaefer. Looks like two for Gapshees. Eleven for Mann. Two for Plotsky. And that'll do it. At the end of the regulation here, the Mariners will win 43-27. We appreciate you watching on Cable CTV 6. We'll be back for the boys game Friday night here from the gym. And we thank Logan Mead, Jerry Schneider. I'm Craig Zimmer. We'll see you next time, Mariner fans. Good night, everyone. This CTV sports presentation has been brought to you by St. Clair Chevy, Buick, GMC, We Care. By Murphy Inn Restaurant and Hotel in St. Clair. By Ackett Soups in Adair and Marine City. North Star Bank, guiding the way. By St. Clair Chrysler, Jeep, Dodge, we care. By Neiman's Family Market. By St. Clair's Ace Hardware. And by CTV Community TV in Marine City and St. Clair.